Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. My name is Randy Noko. I'm from the Narragansett Indian Tribe. Can you all hear me? Yes! I don't uh, tend to use the microphone because the voice carries pretty well, but <laughs> I'm honored to be here today. Um, give yourself a round of applause. Everyone in the room. Yeah. I'm not here today on behalf of the tribe, per se. I'm here on, on uh, behalf of an effort, a grassroots effort it's called uh, Status Purple. And if you would indulge me, well, first off, I did have this in mind. A moment of silence, please, for the country, for those that in need, for those that aren't here, that, that want to be here, that are here in spirit, for those that have whatever afflictions, but again, for this country. Thank you. I, I don't want to take any of the motivation that's been going on with tremendous speakers and, and words and, and conversations and, and reasons why we want to support Bernie Sanders for president. But this country, who knew that when we were elected Donald Trump, we we're going to go into moral bankruptcy. We need someone that's going to make the change. We need someone that's going to bring about morality again. You know, to take pride in this country. This country has a lot of things that it can make that can be better. There's a lot of things that are wrong about the country, but one thing we can change uh, right away is the White House and who represents it. Right that would be real quick. I wanted to give um, an understanding of what Status Purple is about. The mission of Status Purple is to create a grassroots bipartisan movement focused on recognizing, defending, and protecting the sovereign status of the only federally recognized Native American tribe in the state of Rhode Island, the Narragansett Indian Tribe. I am not taking away from anyone and what we shared already and what will be shared afterwards. But, and I'm proud of this, I'm proud to be a member of the tribe. I'm proud of, uh, of uh, the history, history of what, how we, Rhode Island came to be. Roger Williams um, had his hand shaken by some of my tribal leaders several hundred years ago. And not shortly thereafter, the hands of my tribal leaders were cut off. So, just an understanding, what Status Purple is all about, is an understanding, the better education of the Narragansett in this case, of Native people, the indigenous people as a whole. You know, this country does have so much going for it but there's so much more that we can learn about each other. The rights of minorities, the rights of those afflicted, the health care issues of those that need it. There's so much more we can do, and Lord knows, this room knows, it isn't happening with the man occupying the White House right now. Yeah. Yeah. That man has to go. Yeah. Yeah. Not, not that chant. You go off that chant. There is, I've been watching some of the Bernie videos and rallies and, and, and gatherings that he's had. And, and again, I'm not taking away from any other issues and what we're bringing up here today. But I, my heart is warm and, 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 and it's all about the Native American issues also. And I feel I can carry that message. Uh, maybe, uh, how many Native people in the room, by the way? Not to take away from anyone else, tribal members of the Narragansett tribe, any other tribe. Thank you for being here. I have a lot of time to give you, but there is um, a couple of the videos I was watching the rallies of Bernie recently, and reason why, another reason why we support him. Time and time again, our Native American brothers and sisters have seen the federal government break solemn promises, and huge corporations put profits ahead of the sovereign rights of the Native communities. I will stand with Native Americans in the struggle to protect their treaty and sovereign rights, advance traditional ways of life, and improve the quality of life for Native communities. 
If I had, if I had no other reason, that reason alone is enough to support Bernie Sanders as president of the United States. appreciate this point. I'm here for Status Purple today. You know, maybe you can glean it on, on, online and, and get to know more about the issues that we're about. Again, I'm not here for the Narragansett Indian Tribe. I'm here as a member of the Narragansett Indian Tribe. And I will carry forever the pride of what I know, what I feel, what that, that means to me. Much like we're here, the pride and, and looking forward to supporting Bernie. Having him elected on November 4th, or November 3rd, recognizing the November 4th. <laughs> but it's been great. Some of the some of the words, some of the motivation that we've had in this room today and the carrying on that's going to be as the, uh, the rallies come up, as the caucuses come up, you know, the issues that we're here in support of. It's it's been an eye-opening experience for me in, in different ways, you know, being here and, and sitting shoulder to shoulder and, and listening to everyone. I know I'm sure I've already spent my time. My son has got to track me down the road, so we're going to duck out quick, but it's an honor to stand here, to sit here with you today. Let's get this done, huh? Yeah.